In this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to do material takeoffs using Intel Build. What you see here on the right is a BIM model. And we are using the Autodesk Forge Viewer to visualize the model. It's the same technology used by Autodesk in its BIM 360 applications. And using the Forge API, we can take the model apart and group all the elements that we find, all the materials, into a classification that you see here on the left. Now we are using Uniformat but you can use any other BIM standard or classification system. And you can browse the hierarchy and whenever you reach the material level, uh, you will see that the quantities have already been calculated. Whenever I select something within the hierarchy, it is also highlighted within the model. So I can go ahead and browse the entire model uh, using this hierarchy and checking the mo visually if it's the right material or not. And it's important to note that it's uh, it's good to have your materials all classified within the model because here we have a lot of materials in this example that are unclassified and not suitable really for, for material takeoff. And I can use other parameters in this table as well, not just uh, the quantity and the classification. I can use any BIM parameter within the model. So here we have a list of all the parameters found uh, from the model and I can go ahead and example add the level parameter so that I can uh, specify which floor I want to look at materials. And I can filter by adding the number 3 here. It will show me only the materials on level 3. I can turn off ghosting so I get a better overview of the materials I have selected. And from this point on you can um, select either the entire building or the materials uh, based on any predefined criteria. For example here I have only selected the third floor materials. I can go ahead and select only the superstructure materials on the third floor and I can proceed with creating the bill of materials.